Hello, everybody. Unfortunately, I don't like the way I look with this uh, hollow business, so one remedy I think I'm going to have for this is to put on that ring that we got earlier. Now, I'm in the way of the blue right now. We get some protection. It's probably going to be helpful, but I may not... I'll choose when I go online to do uh, online stuff, uh, like co-op and getting invaded and stuff like that later. Uh, right now, I just don't like the way I look, so... I'm going to throw on our phantom ring. There we go. So if I'm not human, probably going to throw on the phantom ring. And uh, roll with that. Now, one thing I egregiously apologize. Uh, I was just an egregious error, but I apologize profusely. Is that I did not uh, check the uh, description of each of the uh, each of the armor pieces. Let's take a look. Helm of Kings of the Desert Land of Jugo. First worn by Oris, the land's heroic founder. According to legend, the armor Oris is composed of a mysterious substance that cannot be seen by cowards. What do your eyes tell you? And it does raise equipment load. If, uh, I'm not sure how that works. Um, it didn't seem to be very much. Uh, like maybe only 0.8 for the whole set. But it may... That, that what, I'm, what I'm thinking that means is that it may stack with, uh, it may stack with, uh, you know, with more vitality. Uh, so the more vitality you get, the bigger that bonus will be. I believe the other, um, the other, uh, the other thing, other items are the same. Yeah. So, you know what this also tells me, guys, is it's very likely at some point we may not be considered a coward by the game and our armor will appear and we'll be able to have it non-transparent anymore so that's cool too and uh... who knows maybe that'll give us even higher bonus uh, d for damage or something like that at that point but right now we're cowards so we're gonna have to roll with this one and uh... yeah so we just killed the giant uh... we upgraded our stats we've got everything going last video so let's uh, let's rule on and let's let's forge forward. Now we have a couple options still. We can check out a new area over here. Um, go down this path here, which I did do last game. I won't won't lie, I did check it out. I didn't get very far, uh, but it's called Hide uh, Ruins, I believe, and there's a hide tower there or something. And um, yeah, it's 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 a way to go, but I know that the pursuer is still this way. We've been fighting the pursuer. We we help other people with the, with the boss on pursuer. So maybe we'll go and do the pursuer first. I want to be able to solo solo the pursuer. I don't know if I'm ready to do that yet, but maybe we'll find out. Oh yeah, that's right. We didn't uh, actually finish. Uh, whoops, it's not where I want to go. We didn't actually finish uh, the area at right away after the giant. We got the key, the soldier key from the giant. So maybe we should go try it out um, before we decide to fight the pursuer. I think that's a good idea, actually. And well, now that they're here and we got a little extra stuff, a little extra ad agility, maybe we'll try that jump. Is that a one-hit kill? Pretty close if it wasn't. No, no, it's not a one-hit kill. But we're yeah, we're not we're not getting killed quite as easy. I'm not going to use more throwing knives. Yeah, maybe we'll clear these guys out and try that jump again.
Somebody was telling me uh, that uh, the jumps are a little bit tricky uh, in this in this new iteration of Dark Souls. So that made me feel a little bit better. But they said you have to be facing your jump directly. You can't do diagonal jumping and hope to make it. So I'm not too sure exactly what that means, but uh, well, maybe it'll help us. I don't know. Oh geez, I gotta warm up here. I'm not really not really doing very good here early game uh, from the start of my play, my daily activities here. <laughs> oh, that guy. Well, that guy almost killed me. So let's go get him. Maybe we can get the. We already got a bow, so we don't really need to kill him anymore. But wouldn't hurt to. Well, maybe we don't need to worry about him at all. Let's just go over here and try our jump. Okay, so if I'm supposed to face directly, what would be the most direct angle to take here? Um, I don't know. Maybe there? So we take a straight on angle that way. Come right over the rock. Take, take a straight on angle toward that rock. Is that rock a good target? Yeah, that rock's a good target. Alright, so we'll do that. That wasn't even close, and I don't want to become so far. I don't want to be. I don't want to become so far from non-human that it's. It's really going to bother me. Actually, uh, this, this may be a jump I still need to do later. Although we were so, we didn't even hit it. I mean, we hit the roll button instead. So, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe one more time. Ah, it looks like I go really far now with my jump. If I figure out what makes a one-hit kill and what doesn't, I'd be really happy. Don't try to interrupt somebody in stun in, in, that's involved with swinging, I guess, is the moral of the story in this new iteration. You can't really get away from the stun lock too easy. Oh, come on. Just playing like stank here. Start. And these lower mobs again. Pretty soon they're gonna start disappearing. Yeah, maybe some, maybe a couple, maybe one guy already started disappearing here. Oh, just about bit it down the hole. No, I ran right into that one too. Just annoying. Okay, at least we got some kind of a drop here. Life gem, good. That's the best drop we could have got from him, I think. Okay, for, for crying out loud here. Where's our rock? There it is. Okay, so... Line it up. Oh, for fuck! Okay, that's it, guys. I'm not doing any more. I'm not wasting more time on this bullshit. Oh... I made it the second try, my first playthrough. Probably just built up too much, uh, too much uh, excitement for it here. Well, then again, you know what? I might just put a little uh, annotation in the video, and uh, and burn an effigy on this. Yeah, that's all. I'm, that's what I'm gonna do. It's gonna bug me. So I'm going to burn an effigy on this when I'm finally finished it. If I go all the way down to completely hollow, I could care less. I'm going to burn an effigy. I'm going to get that bloody jump right now, and I'm going to put a little annotation in the video. So if you don't like it, you can you can fast forward through it.
don't know why I'm playing so terrible today. Um, my memory of my playing ability was a little bit better than it is today, that's for sure. Good, a throwing knife. How did I miss that one? Good. Things are looking up. Now this. Well, that's better I didn't die. At least got pulled off the jump, but I wasn't close enough. At least if I can keep doing that, then I won't I won't die at least. Just start using up my Estus. I think I even know what's in there, guys. It's like uh ten throwing knives and uh and a uh soul or something like that so it's not the best treasure in the world it's just that I, I'm achievement oriented kind of guy sometimes not I don't necessarily like all the team this is gonna bug me if I can't even get across this thing I can't call myself a Dark Souls player so I'm gonna get through this one way or another here yay finally <laughs> okay yeah I know I don't want the message soul of a nameless soldier and a th throwing knife time 10 thank you just because we suck, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to give myself a little bit of hope, of a uh, thank you to the crowd for putting up with that. Ah, oh, thank you, dear Lord. <laughs> All right, that's it for that. Okay, and how do we get down without killing ourselves now? Remember these rocks over here weren't too bad, right? Okay, that's it for this. Uh, Anything else that we want to clean up in there? No, I don't think so. Let's just warp from the bonfire here. Okay, uh, travel to Pursuer Land. So the pursuer, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna check out the rest of the area. We can open up one more gate, I think, with this with the soldier key, and actually two gates we can open up with the soldier key, and then the soldier key also opens the gate to the pursuer. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna solo the pursuer as best we can. It might be tough, uh, especially the way I'm sucking today, but we'll try it anyway. I think uh, I think. The that ballista might be a secret, though, for even for soloing the pursuer too. Even even though he's going to come over and try to bust it, I'm going to try to figure out a way to use that ballista solo. Even. All right. Okay. So, where are the places we're trying to open with the key here? Um. Yeah, I think there's one. One door right here that we couldn't get through earlier that I think the soldier key opens. Yep. Unfortunately, there's not much here. Uh, we'll get... Uh, I don't know what we're going to get. Forget. Oh, ring of restoration and three torches. So the ring of restoration is kind of good. Um, it'll allow you to... Uh, we do have a couple souls to use if we ever need them. 
and the boss soul. Um, soul of the giant come and gone prepared for his final rest but his soul remained magnificent testament to his former strength use a special soul of the last giant to acquire numerous souls or create something of great worth well obviously we're going to save it for great worth we don't need any souls that way Needs need any souls just help somebody out that's the way it goes for me all right and uh, what else do we want to check out here um we just picked up right um Oh yeah, the ring. Gradually restores HP. Pass down a house of Asteria. Sacred land of Lindelt. This ring symbolized prosperity and longevity for the great house of Asteria. But the ring is fragile and breaks easily as if it hates being taken for granted. Well, I don't know how it would break, but it breaks in battle? Like what? Is it rings? The rings go into battle now? I, is that how it works? Um, yeah, I don't know what I want to take off for it right now. I got full health. Forget it. I'm not taking it off. Or putting it on just yet. If I, there's ever a time where I think I need it and I need to save Estus or something, maybe I will put, throw it on. But it, it goes pretty slow. I did try it out last playthrough. It goes pretty slow. And, uh, yeah. Try fatty. Fatty ahead. Oh, well, we don't have the symbol of the king, do we? Hint. 847 ratings for hint? You gotta be kidding me. Oh, I see. Somebody, they're, they're begging for a hint, so lots of people want to know. <laughs> I guess that might be a way to get lots of ratings. Hooray for pincer, but rear. Uh, Obviously we're going to fight somebody, uh, I think, when we open that door, but a fat guy, I guess. But we can't open it yet, so... Did I even try to open it yet for you guys? No. P produce the symbol of the king. No, you just can't, you can't even interact with the door uh, until it just tells you to go away unless you produce something there, so... Um, okay, thank you. Yeah, that's a, well, that's a good message. That's, that's a useful message. I'll try to I'll try to rate at least one message in an area where I think I've been that you know has helped by messages. But that of all the messages there, that one helped the most. What does this one say? Ambush? Eh, eh, not really. It takes a long time to ambush. Misfortune? Eh, maybe. But I'm gonna leave a message here saying need soldier key, right? Because that's what that's what it is. We say. Uh, um, Uh, well, try key isn't enough, right? Um, can we mix? I think we can mix stuff together. I've seen people mix stuff together, right? Um, Well, is a boss here? Um. There. Okay, close enough. Wasted enough time on the messages. Alright. It does open up. And I wonder if it's worth it taking a torch down here. I've never done that before, but you know what? Forget it. Tough enemy. Okay. That's actually de well, that's decent. Okay. I mean, lots of people do, lots of little mobs do that. I think I figured that out by now. 
Ooh. Oh, getting greedy. Really stuttered, st staggered me there. Black fire bronze, homeward bone. Who's next? You? Whoa! I got nailed on that one. Airborne. <laughs> Didn't drop anything, did he? Torch. Oh, jeez. Do you have anything we can use yet for projectiles? Let's see if we can equip that. We have enough uh, to equip that uh, crossbow. And we can't use the bow yet because we don't have enough string or decks, right? Yeah. We should probably get enough decks to use the bow, actually. That's probably some. Should have been priority one. Uh, we can use this, though, if we two handed, I hope. So. Yeah, we can. Now we just need to equip some bolts, I guess, if we... or the heavier bolts, probably. If I can... where's my bolts? Where's bolts? There! What do we got? Wood bolts for longer distance. Heavy bolts, 14. They won't go that far, I guess, uh, but they're tougher, hopefully. No, oh, that's not the place to equip them anyway. Down here. Add the... there, I got two different bolts. Uh, how do you select now? That's not... oh, that's not what I want to do. So, jeez! Oh, not enough. One for you. 41. Ah, that's not enough. Waste of bolts. Okay. Ah, that guy's coming here now. Well, that's fine. We'll take him back over into here. Is he going to back up now? Oh, backing up. Well, I don't want to fight those guys on a, near a ledge. So you either come over here and fight over here, or don't fight at all. Because I can't even approach that... the uh... Can't even approach their explosion, it's shock, the shock wave uh, knocks you back. Okay, good enough. He's going to look at me when I go up here now. Okay, great. It's almost worth it to hire a few uh, 
phantoms just to get through this area quicker. It's not like I can't do it if I have to here, but... Ah! He's like going for five shots in a row there. Just Oh, this guy's mad. Jeez, really mad. I guess it doesn't like the fact that I've been cheesing him that way. So we're going to have to figure out a new strategy. This guy's a little bit more aggressive than the other guys, yeah. We will try the uh, side... I know if I know I know that if you go right behind them guys, you sh you're gonna get back uh, laid on. So don't go right behind them. So this side this side procedure looks like it's pretty good for the more aggressive turtles here. Yeah, uh, don't go right behind them. It's gonna get sat on and uh, straight on. That guy was too hard, I think. So or at least it seemed like it. Really like to know how consistency with one-shotting these guys would be achieved, but bastard sword. Heavy great swords designed to be wielded two-handed. Normal swung at large arcs and effective against multiple foes. Be wary that such attacks leave the wielder wide open. Yeah, not my style. It really isn't. But we'll have it in our inventory in case we need it. I guess you can get through the door. Okay, what's this? Okay, so this is... This is where we were earlier, guys. Remember we were in that area with the the, woo, the cartographer. Oh, area with the cartographers up there and all those people shooting at us and stuff. And it was really interesting to see be able to see through here, but not get through here. But now we know that we can get here. This is just get after the giant boss, a soldier key. Oh, I don't want to do that. Don't hit chests in this game. <laughs> uh, oh. Soul of a Proud Knight, Hunter's Hat, Leather Armor, Leather Gloves, Leather Boots. Nice. Uh, that sounds like a very common, common Hunter set that we got, you know, uh, in the previous iterations of Dark Souls. Not as good as the set we have on, obviously, but, uh, whoops, um, soft leather, commonplace, few embellishments, lightweight and easy to use, well, not as light as ours, so, into the inventory box it goes, bonfire ahead, great, um, I want to sit here though. I don't know if I've triggered it or not. Doesn't really matter. I guess I could sit here to make sure. Oh, we already triggered it to get our Estus anyway. So uh, there's nothing we really need to do here. We could travel away. I, actually, I may do that uh, once we making sure we fully check this area. We just travel away. Oh, we've reset the enemies now. That that's still that's why I didn't want to sit down. Jeez. Uh-oh. Jeez. Ah! Okay, let's check out this tree and <laughs> let's maybe homeward bone out of here. <laughs> okay, look at the tree. Isn't that nice? I think it might be the old giant. Um, 
Can't leave a guy in peace, could you? Let's see if we can uh, put them back in their starting spot and get a better better shot at that uh, tree room. Wouldn't mind checking some of the messages in there and see if we can do anything with that tree. But it, my my suspicion is that is that maybe the old uh, the, the giant that we just killed. I always wanted to check into that. But uh, these monsters maybe don't aren't going to let us. Yeah, that guy's. Well, there you go, dead. Hundred percent my fault. I was really stupid. I just uh, decided to jo dodge around him, but also pressed my roll at the same time. So that wasn't really wasn't really a good idea. So if I just aggroed that one, it wouldn't be so bad. But then two of them start coming in. Um. Yeah, I'm not, I don't trust myself to be able to put them off a ledge or anything. Where's the other guy aggro from anyway? I don't know. Oh, you piece of junk. Trying to pick up my souls here. Obviously didn't work. Oh, for fuck's sake. There go my souls now. Fuck! Jeez. It wasn't worth 3,500 souls to fuck around to look at that fucking tree. I'll tell you that much. Pardon my language, guys, but that's just that's just that just pisses me off, and I pay like st so stupid. Oh. There we go. Zero souls. Thank you. One more quick look at the dumb tree, and we're out of here. Regret. No. Yeah, I think I might be the giant. I'm not sure. But we can't do anything. I know that much. I've tried doing things there, and you can't do much there, so now I'm out of here. Down 3,500 souls, but that's fine. We're getting back at the Pursuer boss. Even though I'm playing like ass today, I think <laughs> we're going to try the Pursuer boss anyway. <laughs> uh, there's nothing else. Oh, we didn't go up top, actually. There's, there's something to do on top of the next area there, so since I've only got 50 souls anyway and there's only a little bit of life bar to, to lose, let's let's just go for that and see if we can do that. Oh, for... Jeez! Oh, I needed that. Well, not right now. Why didn't you, why didn't you break my message when... I mean, give me some health when I was dying there. Oh, for crying out loud. Any items here? That's all I'm interested in. Otherwise, I'm out of here. Didn't have enough stamina. I don't see any items up here. Did I? Oh, well, there's some items dropped now. Nameless soldier and something else. Life gem.
Oh, I forgot these guys are all back here now, so... Running out of here wasn't a, a wise option. Should've just... Should've just gone with the, uh... Should've just gone with the, uh... The fu with the, uh... Uh, the, uh... Should have just gone with the um, bonfire is what I meant to say. Okay, well, you know what, guys? There is the photographer still over here. I don't know if I got to talk to it again to come back to the house or not. I'm going to try it. There's an item there we missed, too, by the way. I'm just going to go back to the cartographer to see if we have to talk to him or not. If we don't have to talk to him, whatever, but... I'm going to talk to him and see what, uh... Oh, I can really notice my rolls have a lot of more uh, distance to them uh, now with the extra adaptability. Okay, he's gone. Well, we didn't have to talk to him, but he's, he's gone. And he's... Uh, back at... probably back at Majula, so we'll have to go talk to him, I guess, uh, pretty soon. See what he has to say. Back at his house there. Squatting in Majula. Yeah. All the missing jumps are getting pretty... getting pretty hollow here, guys. I'm not liking it, but... Oh, this woodshed! Or the wood wood was blocking me there. Okay, so we missed a, we missed an item up there. Okay, well, can we get it from this direction? I don't care if we can get it from this direction or not. I'm going this way. <laughs> uh, oh no, no, I gotta ah, I gotta go this way actually to get back here anyway. But okay, so let's go get that item. We missed earlier. Be safe from arrows in here at least. Torch. Well, I'm not sure if it was worth a torch to come back in here and get surrounded by arrow shooters and fall off cliffs here and um well, nobody's left a message here, so let's let's help somebody out here and say uh, something here. Uh, no, I don't like that. Um, How's that? Because you're not going to jump off. You know, you know, you don't want to jump off here. You're going to die for sure if you jump off there. So, and we're back at the start, aren't we? Yeah, nice. Okay, so that's we've done. We've I think we pretty much cleared this area. Pretty much cleared. Now you. We would like to know how to one hit kill them consistently. Maybe I got him in the face. Probably, that's probably what it was. I probably got him in the face. Seemed like I got him in the face there. Okay. Um. So I'm in a kind of a quandary here now, guys. Should I go and fight the pursuer boss, uh, hollow like this? I mean, I'm down quite a bit. 
or should I uh, try to use a effigy? I don't think so, because I think we burned enough effigies in this game already for for stupid stuff. We've only got four. There's th the lady's only got five more to sell, and she stays at Firelink for a long time. So I don't, I don't, I don't think you know. Eff effigies are limited. I'm hearing from other people, so I don't want to burn for frivolous kind of things here. I mean, I guess the pursuer boss isn't frivolous, but. Um, We've done everything we can do here, I think, pretty much, except go maybe back to Majula and, uh, uh, oh, maybe we could level up one more time. Level up one more time, see about, uh, well, if we're really lucky, we could sl sl slip in a quick, uh, Slip in a quick uh, multiplayer to get warmed up. Yeah, why don't we get warmed up with the bosses uh, by doing a quick multiplayer here? See, it didn't take very long yesterday to get going, so maybe maybe it'll be quick. And uh, we do have that other jump, so if it's not quick, we can go and try to do that other jump. Uh, upstairs over this way. Are we getting summoned yet? Okay, we'll try that jump. Get around this turtle. Yeah. Where's our ladder? Oh. Went the wrong way. Here's our ladder. And just in time to be summoned. Okay, whatever. Well, hopefully we'll go straight to a boss here and win. So we can get our 3,500 souls back. <laughs> that we lost in that other area there. From stupidity. I mean, if I wouldn't even, if I wouldn't even trip the bonfire, we would have been sailing on our way out of there. But like an idiot, I tripped the bonfire and reset all the enemies. That was dumb. But, live and learn, I guess. I probably should have been thinking about that, but... Okay. Kakashi tak Takashi. Yes. No friends, just just you and me. Well, let's do her. Oh, another guy. Okay. Gives me full health here uh, when I'm a phantom. Anyway, that's just nice. I don't need that ring anymore, do I? Oh, I don't need the blue one anyway, to be honest. A little bit extra health. Doesn't look as laggy today, at least. And even though I did put the settings onto non cross worlds uh seems like we're getting Japanese players maybe they bought the Jap maybe they bought the North American game a little bit laggy maybe. already. I'd like him to be a little mo more in the center here. I don't know why those guys like fighting him over there on the side. But, I insist. Oh yeah, see that's why I didn't want to fight him in the bloody corner. 
Yeah, exactly. Idiots. It's not like I lost any health on this boss soloing him myself, but if you sit there in the corner. Uh, my stupid I'm you know, I'm not having a good a good day. Maybe I'll just erase this video. <laughs> <laughs> Not having a good day at my family, guys. I'm blaming the other guys, even though it's my fault for being such an idiot. Uh. Well, I got a lot of token of fidelities, that's for sure. I think I had uh, 11 or 12 on my first character, because I did a lot of uh, co-op helping people out. And uh, right in the middle of the action here now. Wow. That's really... That's really intense to be put right in the middle of all those enemies. Uh, where's my ladder? There it is. I don't know. I'd rather just get started with the, uh, the multiplayer. Worry about that jump. But if it takes people a little while to hire me then uh, we'll go do it but otherwise first I'm gonna get some more health more S. We got four S this class we might as well go refill okay and there we go good Good timing. I'm assuming those guys got the boss. I just didn't get any souls. So I got I got nailed. When I, mean, I felt like an ass sitting out back out there and not helping out, but why why would I want to help out and go into danger when you don't have to? That boss is so easy. Keep him in the center of the room. Instigate his attack, dodge behind his attack, go behind him, and kick ass on his feet. And then get out of the way of the foot. That's that's the whole boss fight right there. It's the simplest boss, you know, in the game so far. It's the first boss in the game. Starts out easy. Shouldn't be too tough. Even though I died like I know I died a few times in my first character figuring all that out. But uh yeah. Not a hard boss once you get once you learn what's going on there. Okay, that's probably their first time. I shouldn't be so critical. It's uh, their first time going through the area, so... First time seeing the boss, probably, and they're doing pretty good, so... And we got another one right away to go right away here anyway, so... And actually, those animations, me getting like thrown across the room, is actually a good animation. Uh, we, there was some criticism from a people, few people I watched on YouTube after the beta, that was going to suggest that uh, that uh, you know the animations weren't finished in the beta, and they probably weren't because it was a beta, right? But uh, they really, um, you know, they finished off the animations. That's a pretty good animation. I mean, if you're getting thrown across the room, that was similar to what they were complaining about. Like you don't have any of that, is the problem. So. Yeah, that's uh, that's been a relatively improved. Okay, yeah, come on. There we go. Go behind. Well, it's still moving on me here. Doesn't seem to be lifting his legs this time. Laggy or something, maybe. That see you don't want you don't want to get foot stomped. <laughs> That's the phantom. Where's our host? Our host still here? Yeah, our host is still here. K. 
Get away from the foot stomp, buddy. <laughs> oh, he's ripping his arm now. Just dangerous, though, so watch out. Well, we were lucky there that that arm didn't get us. Oh, I was lucky that one didn't get me. Getting a little greedy here. Sort of got to coordinate ourselves here a little bit, right? Well, I got a little piece of his foot as I was way by. you guys too because he shouldn't he, he was doing pretty good that guy knew what he was doing I thought like he wasn't he wasn't staying under the feet I don't want to go back to Majula with zero souls I want to get at least <laughs> two levels before I take on the pursuer here see if I can't make myself hum closer to human by winning a couple boss fights that wouldn't be bad right or I can just burn an effigy. Maybe I'll just burn an effigy. If this doesn't work out. One more shot, guys. And if it doesn't work out, I'm burning an effigy for the Pursuer. Okay. Now, they'll probably die a few times on the Pursuer. Let's... Screw that. Let's just go to the Pursuer. What's the, be what's the best ring to have on for the Pursuer? Um... Geez, that's really laggy. I thought I was getting a good backstab there, but I guess I, guess I wasn't. Okay, um... Let's, uh, figure out what wing we're, ring we're going to wear, I guess. Uh, yeah, wear the health ring for the uh, boss fights, I guess. Um, and 1,300 souls to take in there. Now nah, we can, we can spend those. Let's, 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 uh. Wouldn't mind, uh, sorry guys, a really in big indecision here, but I'd really like to practice the Pursuer once, maybe with, or twice, <laughs> just to get into the feel of the Pursuer. Uh, I know nobody seems to be summoning us for, for that, but mostly giant fights here, but I'm going to try one more time here. Um, yeah, we'll go try that jump if nobody's... Nobody summons us, but people are summoning us pretty quick, it seems like, so. We really got 19, 19 gems, that's... That's a lot. I'm not dying too much, then. Okay, let's remember to go the right way this time, which is this way. And not getting summoned this time, so that's, that's interesting. No, oh, it takes about that long to get the sign down, I think, into the where it's through the net code. It's almost instant instant summons. So that that basically means, guy, that the, the, the way the game is going right now, there's instant summons available. I think it took that long just because that's how long it takes you to get through the net code. At least that's my guess. At 
at least this other jump over here I don't I won't die if I miss it <laughs> it'll be annoying to watch but <laughs> at least I won't die and yeah maybe maybe we will use a human effigy eventually on the boss fight but I don't know I'm gonna, probably gonna die a couple times on him so maybe we'll just leave it leave ourselves hollow for now all right let's do it buddy death ray pursuer no 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 okay no pursuer Oh, maybe we are. Or we're going this way just to check it out, I guess. He wants to check things out back here, maybe. Ah, boy, really playing like tit today. Did he already get that item? I don't know. Maybe he already got it. Oh, he wants to do Pursuer. Perfect. That's just what we wanted. I think Pursuer is a little bit extra souls, too, if we actually do it. Summon somebody else. Come down here. Don't let him, don't make him. Don't let him hit the ballistas. Get over here, buddy. See, that's what happens. I'm not gonna go die over there. Come on, like come on over here and get him in front of the cannon. Guess we have to fight him solo here now. No di- Take a long time. But it's good practice for me, I guess, yeah.
There we go. Good job. See, look at that. Five grand. Would have been easier <laughs> to use the ballistas. <laughs> But nice to know that maybe oh, maybe we can even maybe we can so that was a good warm up guys okay we we can we can uh, we can fight the pursuer ourselves now I think I, I just don't like the idea of doing it you know by myself with uh, him always on to you right if he's always on to you it's gonna be pretty intense maybe we can do it but I really like to be able to get him down on one side run down on the other side get the ballista get one shot of ballista then run back so he doesn't k break the ballistas maybe it's not gonna work maybe we'll have a hard time doing it but I'm gonna try so. So obviously now we got enough souls to go back and do some leveling. Maybe we'll try this jump first just to see what's going to happen here. Okay, so the you guys out of my face. A couple throwing knives. One. Two for you. Whoops. How come you're not targeting properly here? One. Two for you. And there's one more guy down there who we will not be able to face until we miss the jump I guess so what I was told was that you go straight on don't go on a diagonal not even close let's kill this guy though Oh, this guy's here. Ah! Jeez. Not what we wanted here. How was it that guy didn't die? Turtle guys don't climb ladders, do they? I gotta better make this jump this time. I don't want to keep going through there. Oh, for cr it's one thing have not having to register at all. Long enough stagger there? Jeez. Oh, for crying in the sink. I can do it now. <laughs> I can do it now. Okay. Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> uh, I've, I don't use a lot of homeward bones, so let's just do it. Save some time. Don't want to get into the habit of using those all the time for stuff, stupid stuff like this, but just save some time. And I'm gonna think if anybody ever comments on these videos or watches them, I'm going to. Uh, 
see if if maybe uh, I can start doing some editing. Maybe edit. I'll do all the loading screens for starters, <laughs> and edit some stuff. I know I had a really hard time editing at first. I don't really know my program that well. Cyberlink uh, producer 12 or whatever, director 12. Anyway, it's uh, it it'll, it will allow me to do some pretty advanced editing, um, unlike just the, the regular YouTube editing. So. I'll try and see if we can do some of that to get rid of these loading screens and poor laggy uh, boss fights or whatever bot, uh, co-op sessions and stuff. So look at that, I'm human and I got full health. Uh, and my ring is going to push it right up there so I don't know how that works. I mean, um, I, I didn't notice when I did that. Um, anyway, okay, well maybe I should have reviewed the tape and <laughs> see if it was after that last boss fight or not. So, uh, we got some souls. Let's go unload them at Majula. Then we'll take on the Pursuer to end the ta uh, hopefully end the stream. We've actually been going quite a while. I should probably close down this, this file. Maybe I'll just do that before we switch over to the new file, yeah. So we'll do some loading up here, and then we'll maybe we'll close down this, the file and start a new one. It'll go up. It'll go up today, guys. Don't worry. So if you're hoping to see Pursuer right away, it'll take me an hour to upload it anyway. Seek the king, lest this lands. Any mystery shards again? No. <laughs> oh. We wouldn't know unless we try. No, okay. And here we go. Okay. My vitality is actually getting pretty good now. So that drives down the equipment burden. What do we got for equipment burden right now? Uh, 59.5. Not bad. And our endurance poise is pretty poor. I don't know what, what kind of poise we can get. It was pretty bad on those guys, but putting endurance up a bit, I could go to 11. It would push us over 100 for stamina. Didn't seem to improve my... Oh yeah, it doesn't improve the equipment. It does improve the poise quite a bit though. So improves poise and stamina to raise the endurance. Uh, I save one to, to maybe put into vitality. 61 or adaptability. How's my agility doing there? 93? Well, maybe we'll do that. With the boss fight at hand, the pursuer, I think the most important thing to have right now uh, might be the agility though. Let's see how much it, uh, we can get. Uh, 95. It goes up two levels and it does not the first one. Um, well, let's do two of agility and one in endurance. I'm not even sure I really want to wear that shield on the back. It might help you if I got hit in the back, but... Still got a thousand souls to go over and use in the blacksmith area. Get some arrows or something. Oh. Titanite shards we could buy too. Why not? And then try to upgrade something. Uh, we won't have enough souls probably. Yeah, I could burn some consumable souls, but I'm not going to right now. That's that's it. Uh, we got full durability. Let's call it a stream here, guys, and uh, do the pursuer first thing next video. Okay. Bye for now.